It turned out that uh, actually in Krakow, people inhaled over 2,000 cigarettes a year, which is seven cigarettes a day, and that counts for everyone, pregnant women, little children, elderly people. In Poland, every year, all, over 45,000 people die because of air pollution, and it's 13 times more than the number of casualties on roads, accidents. My children were really small, and when I thought that uh, they would have to live in the city with that dirty air, it really motivated me to, to do something uh, about it. We just used Facebook and started posting the actual air quality information and data on Facebook to just start informing people that air quality in Krakow is really, really bad. Air doesn't have any political bias, right? Everyone has to breathe, everyone has lungs, has heart. Uh, and you suffer from air pollution regardless of whether you vote right or left. The basic step that we have to do is to ban um, solid fuel heating. You want to ban coal in Poland, it's impossible. People will die because of coal. We protested, we organized marches. But we uh, tried to remain really, really positive. Our movement, of course, talks about the problems, but the, the very next step is to offer solutions, show the decision makers that they can actually do something about it, and the change is possible, and it's actually not so, uh, not so difficult. And I think it's really nice that Krakow was, you know, just the first city that started like, a, like an avalanche of change. We work together with different governments to find solutions and to propose new laws and also uh, financial instruments like subsidies. When we started our campaign, they counted the coal boilers and it turned out uh, there was uh, around 30,000 uh, coal boilers at that time. And still uh, 4,000 are active in the city and now it's illegal to, to burn uh, coal and wood in Krakow. By protecting the air, you can kill two birds with one stone. Investing in air quality and air quality improvement, you can actually also invest in climate uh, protection. <laughs>